Hello, this is Kevin with 3G Store, and today I'm going to show you the Cradlepoint AER2100 and how to insert the SIM and embedded modem. The items that you'll need are the AER2100, included modem cap, screwdriver, included multi-purpose tool, and then an activated SIM card for your carrier. On the side of the AER2100 is a panel that has pass-throughs for antennas and two screws that you'll need to remove. Once those screws are out of the way, you'll be able to insert the included modem. Grab your screwdriver and carefully remove the screws, being careful not to lose them or strip them of their threads. At this point, you could simply use the screwdriver to pop the side panel off of the modem cap, but they actually give you an included tool. Using this retaining tool and the two hooks that are on it, you'll be able to grab onto the panel and actually pull it loose. Go ahead and slide the two hooks into the two holes on the top and then simply pull backwards. This will loosen the side panel and get it out of the way without damaging any of the finish. With the side panel removed, now it's time to prepare your included modem. The cradle point logo is on the top and facing towards you will be the USB port and SIM slot. The SIM slot is not labeled, so it's important to do this properly. Gold contacts face down and the notch side goes in first. Click the SIM into place and you're ready. It will not completely fit inside the modem cap and it is meant to stick out. It's completely normal. With the modem cap in hand, go ahead and line it up with the AER. There are two guide rails where this will sit in and slightly push it in and it will click into place. The AER's modem cap will fit flush with the unit and at this point you can replace the side panel. This is as simple as lining it over the antennas and making sure it sits flush. Now just reattach the screws and antennas and you're ready to go. For more information, visit 3gstore.com slash AER2100. And for more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.